lift of the neck. So I want to define that jawline so I have one thread that's along the jawline and then several underneath for the submental area where there's a lot of loose skin, double chin area. So it's not as much mass. If there's mass, I dissolve it with Kybella first, but there's not a lot, it just becomes loose skin. And then so I zip it up with the threads here like, like so, and then I'm gonna cut it so that, and there's one that engages here, so it lifts up as I engage it. So this is gonna be have less loose skin hanging, and the whole thing will be one more streamlined upwards. This is what I want. Define that jawline as well as making the loose structure down here much more, um, more obliterated from that. Of course, I cooked this already with ultrasound, so tighten the skin so that it will stimulate collagen formation. Um, previously, there's some neck bands. I injected the neck glands with Botox, so the neck glands got, um, you know, kind of relaxed. So when a patient try to strain their neck, it does not show that little stringy signs, which is kind of, um, you know, not so good looking in, in, uh, in a lot of patients' viewpoint. So different things for the neck, um, Botox, threads, as well as focus ultrasound to streamline and contour and make it smooth. Thank you. Neck lift. This is uh, these threads are quite thick, so it's a very nice material to lift up the neck, as you can see that, like that, like so. So I'm trying to get that structure all lifted up here, and uh, put that laid down like that. You can see that it uh, defines the neck. So this side is much more lifted up compared to this side that's untreated. So we're gonna do that on this side too. So less of these lines that are more ver um, horizontal lines because it's been obliterated by the lift. He's got magic hands. Right you can there. you can see it, right, Ernie? Yeah. Right here. Yes. It's uh, it's more elevated. It's very defined. It's it's mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Can you hold a little bit, John? Mm -hmm. wow. yeah. Give you more stuff here. So this is the pilot. The pilot needle is the one that gives that break in the skin, right? And now these are blunt cannulas. So see that? It's blunt. So blunt cannulas doesn't have as, as much trauma to the skin. So the entry is already through the, the one that I already numbed up and that's the break in the skin. Now I'm gonna get into that superficial subcutaneous layer. Get into that. There it is. So now I'm under, right under, and you see I'm gonna slide it across, right there along the jawline. So there'll be a little pain here. Just try to bear it, Virginia. Bear, so you see that? That whole mus, whole um, jawline, I'm at the tip of the chi chin already, so that comes out. So this is right along the jawline. Once I pull, see that what it does? It just streamlines that whole jawline that defines it. 
Now if I pull from the bottom, which I'm gonna do, everything becomes more of a contoured look. Once it pulls up, everything is less loose skin right there. See that? Now I want a two, like going down. Issues on the lower poles. Up. This is for the lower. Last one. I'm gonna go this way. It's like a fan. I try to fan it so that uh, you have one point of entry and then everything else is lifted from that superior hole. So it's a vector, right? Right there. So try to bear with me a little bit. Okay, this is lifting from this side up. Very good. Okay, I'm gonna cut those and then it'll be streamlined, okay? Okay. We're good, thank you, thank you. Say again? Does the end of it dissolve? Yes, all this will go in there and then uh, stimulate collagen and we'll be lifted and then it will dissolve inside the body. The body will absorb it actually. Okay. Right, we did it. All right. <laughs> we did it. Right. So very much a contoured look on the neck. The jaw lines popped out, less of the loose skin uh, down here. We used to have a little turkey neck right here. It's all zipped up. So uh, very nice, no, no bruising because of blunt cannula, very, very important. Um, areas is gonna, you're gonna feel like a pressure. I had it done myself. So pressure sensations, I able to be blocked, but in terms of the pain, um, tolerable because of the, uh, lidocaine and epinephrine that was given here. The local anesthetic is all that's necessary. Um, patient tolerate very well. And wide awake, very safe. No downtime, maybe a little swollen over one day, and that's about it. So very nice neck lift, neck lift. Uh, that took what, maybe 30 minutes? Yeah, so really nice. Thank you.